Once you've added activities and resources to your course, you may wish to edit or reorganize them. To do so, click Turn Editing On. You will now notice that various editing features have been enabled. Next to each item and section will be respective edit menus. To edit an entire section, you would click the foremost editing menu, located at the top. To edit the name of a section, you would click the edit section option. You can also hide a section here, which would disable the student's ability to see anything within that section. Next to individual items, you will also notice other editing menus. Within these editing menus are various settings. You can edit the general settings for that item. You can indent them, hide them individually, or duplicate them so that an exact copy is made. You can also delete the item here. If you happen to delete something unintentionally, you can click Course Management and visit the Recycle Bin to retrieve the deleted item. You'll also notice that next to each item is a four-way arrow. By clicking and dragging that arrow, you can reorder items within a given topic. If your course is in the One Topics format, which displays sections as tabs across the top of your course, you may wish to move items to a different tab. To do so, you would scroll to the bottom of the section and select Tabs Edition Utilities. Under Move Resources Between Tabs, select Disable. You'll now notice that a new type of arrow has appeared. To move an item to a different section, click the two-way arrow that says Move. Now navigate to a different section of your course and click on a dotted box where you would like to move that item to. By visiting that section, you'll now notice that that item has appeared. To revert back to the four-way arrow, go back down to Tabs Edition Utilities and click Enable under Move Resources Between Tabs. Once you are done editing, you can click Turn Editing Off.